Hello guys, welcome back. This is now issue 71 of Build Your Own Back to the Future DeLorean. Okay, so yes, this is issue 71 and we're going to be taking a trip down memory lane. Well, not that much of a memory, but for about four, uh, four issues ago, we did started the left door. We're now going to be starting the right door. So we're going to be doing all the same thing again on the other side. So without further ado, let's crack on. So as the last one, we've got the right door. Uh, we've obviously got the controls again. We've got the armrest. We've got the handle, the strap. And then we've got the rear lock here, the front lock, and we've also got the lamp fixings here. Uh, so we've got this piece and then those two black pieces, if you remember, we had. And then obviously we've got the lenses. So we've got two red and we've got like an orange or amber one, if you like. And that's it. And we've got some JP screws, KP screws and AP screws. So without further ado, let's crack on. So first of all, we're going to need JP screws and obviously the door. So we're going to take the door lock, now which is the front one, which is 71F. And we're going to place that into this side as before like so just sits in there and then we're going to secure it in there with a with a, a JP screw this time so let me just grab my screwdriver and I think the small one will be good for this perhaps no I'm going to need to use the uh, the actual one supplied by Eagle Moss for this because I need the length so yeah that goes in nice and easily anyway and then try and make that as straight as possible And then there you go, so that is that secured in. Again, don't over tighten it because it's only plastic. So that is that part done. Do, 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 do. The next part, we're going to be doing the other side. And again, on this one, there's a locating pin just on the bottom there. So that will fit in there like so. And then again, we're going to use a uh, JP screw for that also. Just line that up. And then that will go into that hole. There we go, and then that is that secured into place just there. Next, we're going to be putting the lamps in. We want the red ones, uh, and they are going to go where are we uh, at the back here? We want a lamp, and that just slots in the groove. Oh. This groove here that will just sit in there like so so then it will go through there now it's asking us to put this other one in as well but I'm not going to do that because that's obviously going to fall out uh, when I try and do it so I'm going to skip ahead a few steps and put this one in first so for this this one we're going to be using this uh, this fixing here which is the gold one and the small hole there is going to fit on this locating pin uh, 
like so. I'll just line that up again. It's a little bit fiddly, but we'll get there. There we go, and then it should look something like that. So the little hole goes on that locating pin, and obviously that holds the lens in there nicely. And then we're going to be using for that an AP screw to secure that in. So let me just grab those. Uh, come out of the bag, there we go, there we go. And then obviously that's going to go in this larger hole here. There we go, and that is that lamp secured into place there. And then we're going to move on to this middle one. So again, that's just going to slot in like that. And then we're going to be using one of these black fixings, and these two are different. As you look at it, One locating pin, if you can just see there, is more to the right, and then this one is in line with the hole directly underneath. So we're going to be needing that one for this. And then the locating pin is going to pop into one of those holes, the lower of the holes there. Oh, and I've just dropped it. Uh, come here. Right, let's try again. There we go, and then that should look something like that. And then again, we're going to be securing. Oh no, we're going to need a different screw for this one. We're going to need a KP screw to secure that middle one into place. So I'm just going to do that carefully now. Now, there we go. Lovely jubbly. And then that is that secured into place there. Okay, and then we're going to be doing the orange or amber one, which is going to go just up here. If I can get that to sit in there. And it doesn't want to fit, actually as nice as I'd hope. Let me see. Okay, yep, yeah, so that is that in now. So we're just gonna pop that amber one in there, or orange one. And then we're going to use the other fixing with the off-centered locating pin. In there like so. And then for this one, we're going to use another KP screw. So again, we're going to carefully screw that down there we go just a little bit more tighten there we go and then that's that part in just there 
and obviously as we have previously the LEDs will go into the corresponding holes okay the next job is we're going to be doing some of the strap so doo -doo -doo -doo, we're going to take the slanted bit as you look at it you've got well a longer this longer piece here the longer hole through there so as you've got that to your right we're going to take the strap and I'm just going to straighten it out and then we're going to pass the strap through that larger side then back through the other side eventually and then we're going to fold that back round and through the loop which I may have to, ah oh, there you go, I thought I was going to have to do some tweezers then and straighten that up a bit because it's all a bit skew if there we go so we should have something that looks a bit like that Okay, then what we're going to do is fix this into the door. We'll try and fix this into the door, should I say? I'm getting it all caught. there we go and then from the other side we're going to uh, secure that with two AP screws in those two smaller holes there Uh, so that's one in and then the other there we go and then we've got something that looks a bit like that okay then the next thing we're going to do is turn this over and fit the door switches now this is only going to go in one way um, as you because if you try and put it in the other way it's not going to fit so we're going to put the door switches just in the top there and secure them in with AP screws that's one and then the second one in the other side and there we have it okay so yeah that was it for issue 71 so yeah, next month we'll have 72, 3, 4 and 75 and I expect we'll be completing the right door and putting all the electrics in so we're probably going to be mimicking what we've just done this month. 
so yeah until then if you um, if you are subscribing to me then thank you so much you will get notifications of my R2D2 build which I'll be posting up um, in the next few weeks when they arrive uh, if you haven't subscribed already and you're interested please hit that subscribe button and a like and share and you will keep be up, be up to date with all my builds so yeah until then take care and have a good evening